Subscribe to Extreme Droid channel and press this bell icon and be the first to watch the latest tips and tricks videos. Google Assistant A smart, intelligent and easy to use virtual assistant that has changed the way we used to look at virtual assistant. Now, Google Assistant is basically the next generation of Google Now on Tab with more conventional interface and I personally liked it. Even though Google Now on Tab is replaced by Google Assistant but still it has few tricks up its sleeve that Google Assistant yet can't perform. Now I am aware of the fact that we can access Google Now on Tab inside Google Assistant. So folks, in this video, I am going to show you 5 cool things that Google Now on Tap can do better than Google Assistant. Excited? So let's get started. First, search via camera in real time. Now, if you are one of those who like to travel a lot and explore new things, then this trick will definitely come in handy. By using Now on Tap along with your camera, you can access information about an object or monument about which you don't know. To do that, just point your camera towards the object, then press and hold the Home key to access Now on Tap, and here is everything that you wanna know. You can also do the same thing using an image or you can extract information about any product. But in Google Assistant, you can't do that. Second, take screenshots and share it on the go. Now how we normally take a screenshot? I guess most of you guys will say by pressing and holding volume down plus power key at the same time. But Google now on tap can make things simpler. Let me show you how. For instance, you are looking to buy some cool tech on Amazon and finally you found it. Now you want to share it with your friend by taking a screenshot of that product. Now on tap makes taking screenshot and sharing them lot easier. Simply activate Now on Tap from the screen and press this share button and boom. Now on Tap will take a screenshot and automatically provide you with all the sharing options. But you cannot perform the same task using Assistant. Like I want to take a screenshot of this page using Google Assistant. Third, get details of movies and music in real time. Now, I am a person who loves to watch lots of movies and same goes for the music. But while watching or listening to a song, I used to collect information regarding that. For instance, couple of days ago, I was watching a trailer on YouTube and in the meantime, I want to know more about that trailer. So I just tap and hold the home button and enable now on tap and here is all the information which I wanted to know. The same thing you can do with the music app while you are listening to a song but in Google Assistant you have to tell the specific name of that movie or song about which you wanna know. Fourth, get details out of your message. Now there are times when we want to check the details of a flight quickly. However, doing a Google search of the flight and then getting details isn't the quickest way. However, if you have the flight number mentioned on your screen in an app or in a chat, then you can use Now on Tap to get all the details of the flight like its departure and arrival time. Now on Tap also lets you track shipment with ease. If you have the shipment details on the screen, you can just activate Now on Tap to check details about your package. Fifth, do Google search on particular words and phrases. Now, if you are one of those who like to read using your mobile devices, then the next trick could be really useful. By using Google Now on Tap, you can Google search on particular words or phrases about which you are reading. For instance, I am reading this article and want to know all the details about this word. So I just selected the word, then press and hold the home key to enable Now on Tap and here is all the details. You can also use this as a dictionary to improve your knowledge about words. So guys, these were some cool tricks that Google Now on Tap can do better than Google Assistant. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you do, then do subscribe to my channel for more future videos like this. And don't forget to click that bell icon to get notified every time I release a new video. So this is Samir signing off and I will see you guys in my next one.